Hi, I know you don't know me. My name's Caitlin. I fell asleep reading Jane Austen. I woke up. I'm in a Regency outfit. I think I'm in a coma. Can I stay here for a bit? From Jane Austen, the beloved author of Emma and Sense and Sensibility. That is Mr. Darcy. He looks miserable, poor soul. Miserable he may be, but poor he most certainly is not. He's not handsome enough to tempt me. That dickhead talking about me? Nice suit, Darcy. So what do you recommend? To encourage affection. I probably wouldn't go around talking behind people's backs and calling them uggos. What on earth have you done to poor Mr. Darcy? I just called him a dickhead. I do not have the talent of conversing easily with people I have never met before. You think that's bad? I'm from 2020 and now I've come to a place where I don't even have deodorant. Darcy's so annoying. Heaven the snob you are. This fall, Focus Features presents the story of a modern woman. Mr. Darcy is engaged to my daughter. That's great, because I have no interest in him. He's supposed to end up with Elizabeth anyway. Who discovered the one person she cannot stand is the one man she may not be able to resist. Could you expect me to rejoice in the inferiority of your circumstances? You didn't want to have this conversation, you know, not in the middle of a rainstorm? You are the rudest person I've ever met. You are so full of yourself. I don't understand why women in the 20th century are obsessed with you. Do you not think him a handsome man? No clue. From the producers of Bridget Jones's Diary and Love Actually. You have bewitched me, body and soul. I thought she didn't like him. So did I. So did we all. Pride and Prejudice. 